the? Qué bien, Marco, man. Now, if this isn't a high IQ play, then I don't know what is. I'm definitely going to be trying this out in my next match. I'm going to target you, okay. <laughs> Enemy helo! <laughs> well, it looks like our player here knows exactly what to do when being sniped by someone that's not using a monolithic suppressor. Can you mop him? Wait, 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 though. Oh my god, this is wild. Oh, it's stuck. The helicopter stuck up here. Oh. All I can say after this one is what a joker. Yeah. He's trying to snipe too. Oh my god, I just downed him. Right, I'm calling it. This is one of the greatest third parties you will ever see. Alright guys, now I'm sure everyone has seen the trailer by now for season 5. It looks absolutely insane. Something everyone has been talking about for so long is the stadium opening up. It looks amazing. I'm so happy they've finally done it. But I think the largest change that's being added in the Season 5 update isn't getting the attention it deserves. And I'm talking about the train. This is going to be a massive hot drop in every single Warzone match, I guarantee it. I come from a background in Apex Legends, and when they added the train mechanic in Season 3, it was a game changer. Guys, you have no idea how much the game is going to change. It's going to be absolutely mad with this train. I'm sure tons of game modes are going to come out surrounding it. I cannot wait to see the amazing gameplay everyone's going to be submitting, not only in Season 5, but awesome clips on top of the train. But let me know, guys, in the comments what you're looking forward to in Season 5 the most. Now let's get back to the highlights. <laughs> now this is how you solo an entire squad with your floor loot sniper. Oh, okay. 